Hello, got another battle for you here. This is a UU battle versus World Bash for the Pokemon Battle League. Uh, he's gonna leave with Sceptile here. I'm gonna leave with Primate and try to U-turn him, but he lives with about one HP. It's my surprise. I thought I would kill him, and I'm gonna go to Shedinja here because he can't really touch me. I'm gonna try to burn him, but he goes to Nine Tails. Uh, predict my uh, Will O' Wisp, and then I go to my own Nine Tails. So he uh, can flamethrower me, but he uses Dark Pulse instead. A little annoying, but not too bad, because Ninetales is bulky. He now goes to Clefable, so I, I put that to sleep, which is better than other status effects, because he has Magic Garb. He then goes to Arcanine to absorb my, my flamethrower, but I knock the pot instead. But since he has extreme speed, I can't really do much, so I go to Frost Sauce. He then switches it out, and goes to Sceptile again to use it as uh, Death Fodder. Well, he goes to nine tails again. I shot a ball. Think I might be able to kill it, but special defense is pretty high. But he just nasty plots and doesn't really do anything. He's got to switch out. He then goes to Clefable, which can't uh, I can't hit now because of specs. So I go to Steelix to get Stealth Rock up, which turns to, out to be a pretty good uh, thing for me. He goes to Weezing, which uh, Steelix can't touch. I go to Claydol, which can do something to it and tank it. He goes back to Clefable, which Claydol can't really touch because Magic Guard stops Toxic and uh, Clefable's too bulky for me. I go to Prime Ape, which takes out Clefable, but he wakes up then and I can't really do much. I just do turn out here to do a little scouting and go to Frost Slice to uh, hit his Weezing. But of course, he's going to go back to Clefable right here. He's just switching between these two walls and trying to wear me down. But luckily, I'm the one with Stealth Rock. <laughs> I now go to Nine Tails, thinking he might flamethrower me, but he uses Thunder Wave instead. This is kind of annoying because Nine Tails really hates being paralyzed. So I just keep Nine Tails out here and try to do, some do something with it, put it back to sleep with. Uh, Attack. He goes to Arcanine here, which works kind of, I guess, because he uses a nasty pot and he thinks I'm going to switch. He's just toxic. And I managed to get a decent hit in with Energy Ball, despite it not being very effective. He then goes to Clefable again, who's sleeping, and I get Para Hacks. And I try to uh, get nasty plot some more, to where I can actually hurt it. But he wakes up and kills me with Seismic Toss. It's kind of annoying. So here I go back to Steelix. Now, I know he's just switching to Weezing right here, so I go ahead and just blow up trying to kill it. But it does, it's very bulky and does live with about 1 HP again, which I guess is my curse of the battle because it's the second time that happened. So I go to Prime Ape who can easily take it out. And then with his physical wall gun, he doesn't have much to take out with Prime Ape, so it's a big hop right now. I go to the Frost Slice, he goes to Clefable. Go to Claydol, just avoid, avoid the Thunder Wave because I don't want Frost Slice paralyzed at the moment. I use Earth Power to try to weaken this thing, but it just takes those hits way too well. And I guess it's just because Claydol isn't that great at attacking. I go ahead and try to Toxic it, thinking it might not have a uh, Magic Guard, but I should have noticed it hadn't taken Stealth Rock damage the entire match. and maybe done like six more damage with uh, earth power but it wasn't that big of a deal got a prime up here try to scare it off he switches the pincer which is his last pokemon I, that i haven't seen it survives my close combat mainly because it resists it i didn't think it had any party moves but I somehow forgot about Quick Attack, and I got kind of lucky with the, with surviving it, but I probably would have, no matter what, because it was decent in the red. And he goes to, prime, uh, to Arcanine to extreme speed me, so I go to Frost Slice to stop that. And he switches out, killing pretty much killing his Arcanine, because it doesn't have enough HP for Stealth Rock now. He uses Frost Slice to absorb my uh, Ice Beams, and starts healing and stalling me out but I now figure out at this point he can't really hurt my frost slice so it's kinda safe out there but he 
can still stall me out, which would be kind of annoying. So at one point up here, I'm going to switch fossils out. Eventually, it's just stall war right now that I have no chance at winning. So, yeah, here's where it's drawn some sense of Arcanine, which dies instantly, and I switch and go into uh, Shedinja, who would just tear apart everything he's got. And Shadow Sneak is uh, Nine Tails to kill it. And it's leaving him with Clefable, which he has no way of beating, so he goes ahead and flees. And that was be the match. Uh, good game, World Bash.